What's going on everyone? Very excited. Jonathan McDonald here. Um, another unboxing video. So you heard me talk about it. It's finally here. My order from PGX. Fragile Handle with Care. Let's use a little Cobra knife. Little pin knife. Go ahead and get this opened up. Don't even want to talk too much. I just want to get to unpacking. Also, I took the liberty of bringing down the only other graded book I have, which I want on an auction. You guys have seen it. The Eden Sky, done through CBCS. So, and this thing is sturdy, so I wanted to do a comparison with them. And I have seen you know, whoa, peanuts already falling out. So I have seen videos before, you know, I sent the PGX, I've seen videos comparing all three. Um, the most cost effective, the cheapest one, um, you know, it's $13 a book. It's $13 a book. Oh gosh. Um, to send in to PGX and I think it was up to like five thousand dollars once you hit like five thousand then the price went up from there so oh man it's gonna make a mess they spared no expense on that bubble wrap mm. it is a big old ball Hold on, let me pick all this up. That brick. What else is in here? It's like I got some sleeves. mess in there. All right. Let's get to this. Don't want a four hour video. Look at that break. Popcorn everywhere. Amy, get in here and pick up this popcorn. You know, my wife was just saying, man, she wished she had more to clean. She's like, every time I come in there and clean the kitchen, it doesn't get dirty fast enough. So I said, you know, let me help you with that. Starting to see. Ooh. And there we go. All right. On the side again. CBCS. Oh, about the same size. Actually, they are the same size. All right, first one we have is a 6.0 off white John Byrne art cover. Nemar. 
the Submariner, number one. I told you guys I like this cover. I've got three of these now. Only one graded. I know the other one I have, it has to be at least a nine. Oh. You guys see that? Hmm. Hmm. I don't know about that. Let's see if we can do that on the CBS. Man, that thing is solid. I can bend it. All right, let's get to the next one. I don't know why I sent this in. Look, is the top all messed up? Look. Look, it's all wrinkled up here. Another 6.0. X-Factor flashback. Havoc as a boy. What? Look, you guys see? See the scratches? Scratches all on the back. Dang, those are deep scratches too. Well, I guess what they, I guess that's why they say they're the cheapest. All right, we got Punisher Warzone 7.0. Got like four of these now. Venom Lethal Protector number one. Red foil cover. Nine point eight. We got a Amazing Spider Man number three eighty eight, nine point four, blue foil cover. We got Strife's Strike File, number one, 9.4. And it's a wraparound. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, the back is scratched on this one, too. I know you can't see it. There's a nice scratch going right through there. All right, let me show you the front. The back's very cool. I like that. Man. All right, we got X Men number 25, 9.6, with the holographic gambit. Real nice one. You can see it very well. Wraparound cover. All right, we got Exo Man of War. Number zero. Holographic cover. Very, very, very shiny. And it is a wraparound. Extremely shiny cover. Oh, and that's a 9.8 too. We have Bloodshot number zero, Origin of Bloodshot. Wow, that is bright. 
Nice. Look how shiny, shiny, shiny. Wrap around cover. Very shiny. All right, we've got Maximum Clonage Alpha. Number one. An 8.0. It's a fun looking cover. Nice and shiny. I got the Omega, the Maximum Clonage Omega. I might send that in just so I have an Alpha and Omega. Done. Oh, Wolverine number 75. Wrap around cover with a Wolverine hologram. Don't look bad. It's a 9.2. So if I get Wolverine. Wolverine's not popping up as nice as look at his claws. Ching 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 ching. Pretty cool. Alright. And we have, what if, number 50, the Hulk had killed Wolverine, the death of Wolverine. I don't know if I showed you guys I have, what if Wolverine had killed Hulk. I'm going to send that in so I got both of these to put up on the wall. What if you could get an exclusive Marvel trading card? Very cool, 9.2. Oh yes. I got what if number 42, Spider-Man had kept his six arms. And the cover is a homage to Amazing Fantasy number 15. It's a 9.2. And I do have Spider-Man 101, where he has his six arms and his first appearance of Morbius. I want to send that in and then I went ahead and did this I've had this book for a very long time I have quite a few of them it's Turok dinosaur hunter number one the foil cover alien 3 the video game Game Boy and Nintendo. So let's see. Yeah, they all open up. The top and the bottom are sealed. A few of them were scratched. You guys seen the one? Like scratched all on the back. I know there's no way to be perfect with it, but. I guess that's why they send these with them. To protect them even more for... What the... <laughs> Look, guys, it stops. Right there, don't even go all the way around. CBCS's. I told you, this thing is solid. There is no opening this. That is solid. Oh. Another thing. Their um, label up here is on the inside. The same as their top label. So you can see what book it is. Eden Sky number two, 9.8. Theirs is a sticker. Don't look too bad. It is wrinkled. You can see most of them aren't put in right. And so they're wavy. Well, I can see it. Especially when it's laying down. 
You can see how wavy it is. Yeah, the CVCS's is very straight. Barcode on the back with their phone number. Ah, oh, what, what, what can you do? How many did I send in? 14 bucks. Like I said, they're only $13 each. This sent in, get graded. They don't care if it's um, a $500 comic book, $800 comic book. I think they give you up to a, uh, 5,000 before their price goes up and they only charge you a percentage. So they don't charge you. I mean, they got their prices online. You guys can check them out. Uh, everything's on there and they're self-explanatory and then you can print out um, you can print out the list that you're gonna send in. You mark it all down. You total it all up yourself. You send it in and pay. Um, CB, uh, CGC is starting to be a little pain. You have to type in every single one of them. I'm still at typing. I think I've got 16 typed in so far. You don't do a list. And then I think once you submit it, um, they might send you a box. But I'll go a little bit more over that when I go to send in my order my 16 books I'm sending to them. Um, and then I'll keep you guys up to date. Thank you so much. Very excited though. Uh, thank you, PGX. Um, oh, and the response, email, every time I emailed them with any questions, they got right back to me. It usually took about 24 hours, but they still got right back to me. And when I did send these in, you know, we, we have the whole COVID scare, so, um, they did, they, they tried to get it back as soon as they could. So it was only a couple months. So, and they got it back to us. So I'll keep you guys up to date when I go do send in the CGC or CGX or CBC or CBS or whatever it is. So, all right guys, thank you so much. I'll see you on the next one.